subjugation of all Arab peoples. Resistance is as old as the occupation itself. A resistance that has endured for over a hundred years. Gillibrand, how can you say that you represent New Yorkers when 70% of this country demands a ceasefire in Gaza? If you say free Palestine, you have to say free Sudan. If you say free Palestine, you have to say free Lebanon. And if you say free Palestine, then you damn sure have to say free Haiti. Jennifer Gillibrand, you received $366,000 from pro-Israel lobbies in this past election cycle. Why are you allowing your interests to be bought by foreign government? We have witnessed unthinkable crime after unthinkable crime. Rebuilding and recovery will take decades. Hamas doesn't want to return the hostage. They're offering to return the hostage. And when Netanyahu arrogantly last September 2023, right before October 7th, stood at the UN General Assembly and showed a map of the Middle East with no mention of Palestine and no mention of Palestinians, this is what he's talking about. Genocide. Every ounce of dignity that we're losing as a humanity. Israel and the United States respond to the Lebanese with this brutality because of one simple fact. The Lebanese have refused to leave Gaza by itself. They have refused to stop fighting. <laughs> genocide. We also recognize this year of resistance. How many Palestinian children need to be killed before you call for a ceasefire? You have blood on your hands. My people deserve to leave. The bombs may fall, the bullets may fly, but we will remain firm in our commitment against oppression. The resistance will exist until complete liberation and complete return. <laughs> 